The Cane Corso vs. The Rottweiler If you're considering getting a new dog or just curious about these two magnificent breeds, you're in the right place. The Cane Corso and the Rottweiler are both large, powerful dogs that are well known for their powerful builds, great loyalty, and massive affection towards their families. Yet, they have a few differences in things like their history, appearance, temperament, and care needs. In this video, we'll explore these differences and help you decide which breed might be the best fit for you and your lifestyle. By the end of this comparison video, you'll have a better understanding of the similarities and differences between Cane Corsos and Rottweilers and be one step closer to choosing your perfect furry companion. So let's take a look at the most important things to know about these breeds. Number 1. Their Origins Ah, the majestic Cane Corso, a breed that exudes power and grace in equal measure. Originating from the beautiful land of Italy, this remarkable canine has a rich history that stretches back centuries. As a descendant of ancient Roman Molossian dogs, the Cane Corso embodies strength and loyalty, bred for various purposes, from guarding livestock to hunting game. This magnificent breed has always been revered for its versatility and unwavering devotion to its human companions. In the heart of Italy, where the rolling hills meet the azure Mediterranean Sea, the Cane Corso was carefully honed and refined. Its ancestors known for their formidable presence were cherished protectors of their families and estates. Today, the Cane Corso stands tall as a true symbol of Italian excellence, admired for its athleticism, intelligence, and unparalleled sense of guardianship. This majestic breed's journey from ancient Rome to the modern world is a testament to its enduring legacy and a delight for dog lovers worldwide. Similarly, the Rottweiler has a long history and is considered one of the oldest breeds in the world as they were descended from drover dogs used by the Roman legions. Wherever the Roman Empire reigned in Europe, they utilized drover dogs to move cattle. In the 2nd century, the Romans abandoned many of their outposts in Europe, leaving what would become the Rottweiler behind. From the Middle Ages to around 1900, the Rottweiler acted as a working dog protecting and herding cattle while still being a part of the family, especially in continental Europe. The former history of the Rottweiler began in 1901, when the International Club for Leonbergers and Rottweiler Dogs created the first standard for the breed, making Germany the formal country of the Rottweiler, even though they did not originally come from there. Number 2. The Personality The King Corso, with its commanding presence and unwavering loyalty, possesses a personality that is as captivating as it is remarkable. They exude a calm and confident demeanor that demands respect. Beneath its imposing exterior, however, lies a heart brimming with affection and devotion for its family. Intelligent and discerning, the Cane Corso possesses an uncanny ability to assess situations with astute perception. Its watchful nature ensures a keen sense of protectiveness, making it an exceptional guardian. Yet, amidst their vigilant nature, they also possess a playful side that emerges when surrounded by loved ones. Meanwhile, Rottweilers are often called gentle giants due to their large size and laid-back personality. Many people welcome Rottweilers into their homes as protectors, companions for active families, or guardians of children. While these dogs were originally bred as cattle herders, they are no longer commonly used for this purpose, as modern domesticated animals don't require long-distance herding or protection from predators. Instead, Rottweilers' incredible adaptive intelligence makes them ideal for a variety of tasks. They can easily learn new commands by observing their owners or other dogs, and they're skilled problem solvers who can use their past experiences to tackle challenging situations. With their intelligence and affectionate nature, Rottweilers are a great addition to any household. Number 3. Their Appearance The Cane Corso is a breathtaking breed boasting an impressive physical stature that embodies strength and grace, with a height ranging from 23.5 to 27.5 inches at the shoulder and a weight that can vary between 88 to 110 pounds for females and 99 to 120 pounds for males, this canine commands attention wherever it goes. From its robust and muscular build, every inch of the cane corso looks powerful. Its broad square-shaped head is complemented by a strong, defined muzzle and a set of piercing, expressive eyes that emanate intelligence and confidence. The short, dense coat of the cane corso clings to its well-defined musculature, highlighting its athletic prowess. Its regal posture and noble stance make it a truly awe-inspiring sight to behold. Likewise, Rottweilers are some of the most striking dogs around. With their impressive size and muscular build, they're definitely hard to miss. These pups are known for their square, powerful snouts and floppy ears that hang down close to their heads. Rottweilers are typically black with tan markings, and their short, dense coats make them easy to care for. 
While they can be a little slobbery at times, their loose lips are just part of their charm. These pups come in a range of sizes from petite females at 22 inches tall to towering males at 27 inches, and they can easily weigh anywhere from 80 to over 120 pounds. With their hefty build and striking coloring, Rottweilers are sure to turn heads wherever they go. Do you like this video? If so, it would make our day if you would subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss new videos and can learn more about dogs every day. Number 4. Their Trainability The Cane Corso stands out as an intelligent and versatile breed, with a sharp mind and a strong desire to please its handler. This magnificent canine is highly trainable in the right hands. They quickly grasp new commands and concepts, making training sessions a rewarding experience for both dog and owner. This breed thrives on clear boundaries and a structured environment, responding well to gentle yet assertive guidance. Their natural loyalty and eagerness to please make them excellent candidates for various activities, including obedience trials, agility, and even advanced tasks like search and rescue. The key lies in building a strong bond based on mutual trust and respect to unlock the full potential of the canine Corso's trainability. Get ready to be amazed by the intelligence and versatility of Rottweilers. With a history of being trained as cattle guardians and herders, these dogs are natural-born protectors and quick learners. Their adaptive intelligence is truly impressive, allowing them to excel in various canine sports and work well in partnership with humans in various functional roles. Rottweilers have a reputation for being excellent watchdogs, thanks to their calm yet alert nature and willingness to learn new commands. Don't underestimate the potential of these gentle giants. They are much more than just a pretty face. Number 5. The Time Investment Needed Owning a magnificent cane Corso is a commitment that rewards you with a lifelong bond. When it comes to time investment, be prepared to dedicate quality moments to your beloved companion. Regular exercise is crucial to keep this athletic breed content and healthy, requiring daily walks, playtime, and mental stimulation. Grooming their short coat is a breeze, with minimal shedding and occasional brushing to maintain its lustrous shine. Investing time in training and socialization is also essential, as cane corsos thrive on structure and positive reinforcement. With your time, love, and attention, you'll witness the remarkable growth and happiness of your cane corso, creating memories that will last a lifetime. Rottweilers may be big, but they're actually pretty low-maintenance dogs. Their short coat doesn't require much upkeep either, just a quick weekly brush. However, be prepared for some drool as some Rottweilers tend to be slobbery. Also, they can easily become overweight if they don't get enough exercise, and these intelligent pups need mental stimulation and socialization to stay happy and healthy. Without proper training and attention, they can become noisy or destructive. But with proper care and love, they make loyal and affectionate family pets. Number 6. The Cost of Ownership When considering the cost of owning a cane Corso, it's essential to weigh up the expenses. Purchasing a cane Corso from a reputable breeder can range from $1,500 to $4,000, depending on factors such as pedigree, lineage, and geographical location. Yet, adopting a cane Corso from a shelter is a more affordable option, typically ranging from $200 to $500. These fees often include vaccinations, spaying, neutering, and microchipping, saving you additional expenses. It's worth noting that the initial cost is just the tip of the iceberg. Owning a cane Corso entails ongoing expenses, including high-quality food, routine vet care, grooming, training, and potential unforeseen medical costs. Responsible ownership requires financial preparedness to provide your cane Corso with the best care and a happy, healthy life regardless of its origin. With the Rottweiler, the most common way to get one is via a breeder. This is also the only way that you'll get one if you want a healthy puppy that's had proper socialization. But you should be aware that this is far more expensive than any other method. A Rottweiler from a breeder will routinely cost between $1,500 and $2,500, and one with a high pedigree can go for even more. Adopting an older Roddy is always an option too, but we wouldn't recommend it for inexperienced owners. All in all, the average monthly cost of a Rottweiler if the dog is healthy and fed high-quality food will probably have you spending around $150 a month. If the dog is poorly bred or has a chronic health issue, it can cost much more. Even so, for the loyalty of a Rottweiler, this is a small price to pay. So, what do you think so far? Do you prefer the Cane Corso or the Rottweiler? Stay tuned for more, and if you're interested in other dog comparisons, check out some of our playlists and discover even more information about dogs. Number 7. Their Health The Cane Corso is a breed renowned for its robustness, with proper care and responsible breeding practices. These magnificent canines often thrive and enjoy a lifespan of around 10 to 12 years, sometimes even longer. 
While generally considered a healthy breed, King Corsos are prone to certain health issues that potential owners should be aware of. These can include hip and elbow dysplasia, cherry eye, heart conditions and bloat. Regular exercise and balanced diet and routine veterinary checkups are crucial for maintaining their overall well-being. As a prospective owner, it's essential to research and select a reputable breeder who prioritizes the long-term health of their dogs. With Rottweilers, while they are generally a tough and healthy breed, they are also often affected by hip dysplasia, a genetic deformity in which the head of the femur doesn't fit properly into the hip socket. Severe cases are extremely painful and often require surgery to correct. They are also prone to developing heart problems and can be quite sensitive to heat. What's more, they are more likely than other breeds to bloat, a condition in which the stomach distends with gas and can twist on itself, cutting off blood flow which can be deadly. Yet, in general, a well-cared-for Rottweiler will have a life expectancy of about 8 to 11 years. Number 8. The Best Home for Them The King Corso with its majestic presence and loyal nature deserves a home that matches its unique qualities. This breed thrives in an environment that provides both mental and physical stimulation, making it ideal for an active and dedicated owner. A spacious home with a securely fenced yard is highly recommended for the King Corso. Their size and need for exercise necessitates ample room to roam and play. A yard that allows for supervised outdoor activities and regular exercise is essential to maintain their well-being. Furthermore, the King Corso flourishes when surrounded by a loving family who understands their needs for companionship and structure. They thrive in a household that can provide consistent training, guidance, and socialization from an early age. Ultimately, the best home for a King Corso is one where they are cherished as a valued member of the family, receiving the attention, love, and mental stimulation they crave. With the right environment and dedicated care, the King Corso will undoubtedly thrive and bring immeasurable joy to their fortunate owners. Man, if you're looking for a loyal and social furry companion, Rottweilers are the way to go. These amazing dogs have a love for people and are incredibly friendly. Unlike other large breeds, Rottweilers have a surprisingly low prey drive, which means they get along well with other animals, including cats. But don't be fooled by their friendly nature when it comes to protecting their family. They can transform into fierce protectors in an instant. They will defend their loved ones with quick and efficient action, no matter if it's the adults, children, or other pets of the household. So, if you're looking for a furry friend who is both loving and protective, a Rottweiler might be the perfect fit for you. Regardless of which breed you love the most, both the King Corso and the Rottweiler are fantastically loyal and powerful dogs that will make brilliant pets for many households.